Okay. I'm sorry about that, you guys. All right, so what I've got is a dog that had zero engagement. I've, everything I'm doing is deliberate. I'm not just playing around or this, that, and the other. Everything is feeding the big picture. So I've got my pager. I'm on zero. And I'm using this on the top. It's the same exact motor as your phone pager. If you find the idea of a phone pager on the collar strange, but a prong collar, not strange. That's odd. That's odd. All right. This dog, I haven't used a lot of words. I'm just going to over there. I'm just going to go towards the door. So that was the pager. There's no words. You said you're throwing. Yeah, I'm acting like I'm throwing on the brake. You can act like you're fast. You're not fast. You're not fast. It sees, I can be way over there. It's still right there. Hi, David. Hello, Bella and Toto. And thank you, David. It means a lot to me that you support my work. But the dog training is, I'm starting to understand, is filled with people whose, the dog is a secondary thing. It's about them, that Aaron Taylor. He's this narcissist. Every video is him. The dog is just secondary. Me, the dog doesn't. So if you said, what am I looking for? I'm looking for a dog that's facing away from the platform so that you're turning it. Okay, so you're Stay over there. This has only been three days working on this. And you have got to get them moving around first. That's one of these people. If I would have started out with stay, this dog wouldn't be doing anything right now. <laughs> I really don't reward the fit, but if you said, what are you rewarding? Yeah, but it's, it's making it's making the chair hang on swing up there. If I'm holding it down, I'm holding the button down. I'm, I'm mashing the button. If you just watched my hand, you would see me mashing the button. So now what I've got is a dog that's defaulting to staying over there. If you said in three days, by making it think it was its own idea, yes. If I would have started out the very first day forcing it up there, it would have said, here, I'm not going to go around this area because it may result in that forcing thing. It is. It's all psychological. It's, it's that simple. So nobody's telling it to stay up there. It's, if you say, why is she staying up there? In her mind, there's, there's some advantage to doing that. And they do market this thing as dogs like it because it gives them a vantage point, a higher vantage point. And, you know, that is their nature. If you said, how can I test this theory? Put your couch in front of your window. <laughs> Put your couch in front of your window. All right, but why don't we get the dog off of there? I can change it off of there, too. Oh, Molly. Give him a second to make that extra move. Me too. 
telling it to get up there isn't going to make it get up there fast. It's not. If someone tells me to do something, I'll, I'll do it when I get ready. <laughs> Okay, so I can work on the deliver. Let me get rid of these two little ones real quick. Molly. So part of you is saying, what's my default? Is it going to go up there? If it's going to avoid... A lot of it is just not seeing the dog unless it's up there. dog is saying, okay, that's why you need these props. Now it's saying, oh, okay, I've, uh, this looks familiar. So that's where you're at. You had as many props as possible. Okay, so I've got the leash, and this is a good trick to teach any of them. I don't have it very good. I'm going to wrap it up a little bit better, though, but that's a pretty easy thing to teach. I like to do three objects. Boom, boom, boom. Aaron, if you're there, you got to get the hand up. The hand is now in the retracted position. my hand. Alright, so now I got, oh, okay, these are the three, these are the three keys with nothing on them. Put it right in my hand. I was like, you can just get your leash. Put it right. 
только помочуется. turning my head away. Okay. <laughs> Put it right in my hand. Anyway, Aaron, if you're there, that's the part that you're missing. That little... My arm is retracting, my hands are here, it might be the default down. If the arm goes like this, just think the opposite of pointing. It's the opposite of pointing. Your turn. Mom. She put it right in my hand. If you said, where can you go with this? Obviously, this can be turned into that default dropped leash thing. <laughs> I'm so proud of her, girl. If you said these objects aren't that dissimilar. Okay, so if she said, how do you start getting them, just get the and. You do have to make the and way bigger. If you said that doesn't look that different than the keys. Mm, yeah. She said, Molly's not meeting her potential. She thinks that's what it is. I've got videos from a year ago. She's doing the same behavior. <laughs> Any of them will do this. Okay. So, 
working on the healing too, and it's it's all going together. The pager is the pager is instead of the leash, so that's it's not well, it's not a correction. There's nothing to correct them for. When these people say we're correcting the dog because of the owner said it pulled. <laughs> That's like the fixing, that's like Nissan fixing the truck because what I said was wrong. I didn't know what was wrong. What I said was wrong wasn't what was wrong. training isn't fun and exciting it's just, it's just you're not gonna even get out there and do it okay Jeff. there's my pager walking 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 there's my pager Cute. All right, listen, I gotta get a quick video of that, but I will be back all morning. Oh. He said, I am a mess. I am a mess, but I don't care about that. I don't care about it. I don't care if anybody likes me or any of that. I just want to be the best dog trainer I can be in my lifetime. And you get to a certain point and you're running out of time and you better get better faster. <laughs> There's not gonna be any more time. You're gonna run out of time. <laughs> 